we're going to work some of these same horses we work flat we're going to work them round and I'm just going to talk to you about how I work kind of the same round as to what I do flat to where I can change angles and all that sort of stuff on a cow and um, yeah we'll just kind of see how it all goes kind of talk you through it all um, so that yeah kind of understand to me when I go flat it's not such a big change to them or when I come back around I can relieve some pressure and fix some things yeah so uh, one thing that I always try to do here is is I always think the hip to drive it so here when I cut a cow I want to drive that cow around and I'm going to be at its hip so I'm going to drive it and when that cow breaks off I'm going to go stop so I want to make that horse so there there where she kind of didn't really stop I'm going to start it again to me this is very important when I make a cut that I can drive a cow and as soon as I let off I want to feel that horse sink to a stop so here I'm going to stay on that hip stay on that hip stay on that hip right here go foot let off there that was better okay so right here now I'm in a really good position to start when I work round um, and this pen square I kind of work square but I work to square to where the cow can go to the corners um, to me if I work if I was like where I'm at right here I have a corner here which I'm going to pretend that's where the judges stand is so that I can work from that corner to that corner pretty much on that angle um, and I like that because it gives a cow a place to go um, whereas if I was working straight along this wall here it's hard to get a cow